Superman of science And he loves to play with fire And the things you do You can do If you so desire Do try this at home With Mr. G Hello and welcome back to Do Try This at Home! Do Try This at Home is the show that takes ordinary household items and turns them into something extraordinary. I'm your host, Mr. G, and what are you going to need to do today's little experiment? Well, you're going to need some cooking oil, some food coloring, a container with some water in it, a clear container that you can see through, about two-thirds full of water, and some ordinary table salt. We're going to be making today what I would call a lava anti-lamp. That's right. You know what a lava lamp is, but this is a lava anti-lamp because there's no light inside of it, so it just makes the lava-like effect and you don't need the heat or the light below it to do this. Now, it's a pretty cool experiment and what you're going to want to do to get started is you're going to want to take your food coloring, pick your color, I'm going to use red today, and you're going to want to put several drops of food coloring into your water. You want that to be pretty colored up good. There we go. Now, I just like to watch the food coloring diffuse into the water. That in, in and of itself is really cool. Now what I'm going to do next is I'm going to kind of shake the water up a little bit here. And we're going to let the food coloring dissolve into the water. I'll compress time magically so that you can see it happen faster. Okay, that's good enough. Now, what you're going to want to do is you're going to take your cooking oil and you're going to want to pour the cooking oil gently into the water. You'll notice something happening. You'll notice that the cooking oil creates these big globules or bubbles down into the water and it starts to separate or float on top of the water. That's right. And let's keep going here. Put a little bit more in there. There we go. And maybe a little more. There we go. Now, I'll compress time magically again so that you don't have to wait for all these bubbles to go away because we want most of the bubbles to be gone. You want the two distinct layers, the water, colored water, and the oil. I'll do the waiting. You just sit back and relax. While we're waiting for all these bubbles to disappear, I'll pull you in a little bit closer. That way you'll get the full effect of the lava anti-lamp. Back to compression of time. Okay, you can wait for all of your bubbles to, to disappear. I almost said appear. You can wait for all of your bubbles to disappear, but I've still got a few bubbles, but I'm impatient and I want to get going. So, what we're going to do next is we're going to take our standard table salt and we're going to pour clumps of it into the oil like this. Now watch what happens as the table salt falls to the bottom and then dissolves, making our lava-like effect. It's really cool. You want small piles, basically, different areas. Here we go. The effect should start almost immediately. The salt drops through the oil and pulls oil down with it through the water. Look at that. And then as the salt melts down at the bottom, or dissolves, I should say, 
into the globules of oil and water, the oil is released and is taken back to the top, but in a slow fashion. And it trails salt kind of behind it sometimes, which makes an even cooler effect. Let's add some more salt. Look at that. What a cool lava anti-lamp. With salt falling down, dissolving, and oil rising back up through the water to the surface. Oh, this is cool. I hope you're getting the full effect out there. It is very neat. And this will start to actually pick up a little bit after it settles for a while. And the salt at the bottom begins to melt, or actually, I should say, dissolve. I keep saying melt. It's more like it's dissolving. When you get these big piles of salt at the bottom, you'll have to rinse out your jar and start over. But you can do this for quite a long time. Ooh, big globs, big globs, look at that. Oh, very cool. Well, I hope that you all had fun with today's little experiment, the Lava Anti-Lamp. Don't forget to visit www.mindlessmirth.com and www.mrgenie.com. Hey, listen, Mindless Mirth is my blog, and if you would join my blog, I would be forever grateful. Both of these links are down here in the description of this video. I'm Mr. G, and I'll see you next time right here on Do Try This at Home! Hello and welcome back. Oh wait a minute. Welcome back to a close-up and, and not seeing my face. The lava anti-lamp. The lava anti-lamp. La 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 lava anti-lamp.